I'm Dr. Nancy McGinley, the superintendent of Charleston County School District. I still wake up every day excited to go to work and I think I'm one of the luckiest people in the world because my work gets to change the future for 46,000 children and their children and their grandchildren and so I think that's an awesome opportunity and I believe Charleston County is on the road to being one of the best districts not only in South Carolina but in the country. Uh, it's hard work because it means all children achieving levels of excellence and not all children have as much support at home. So our job is to figure out what children need to be successful. And if we are successful, they'll be competitive people and they will also be compassionate people because we want good citizens, good neighbors, um, people with a heart as well as a brain. She's very passionate about um, the children in the Charleston County School District and passionate about ensuring that all children have access to a quality education. She hit the ground running when she started her job. We developed goals for the district and she is focused. She's focused on all of the schools achieving uh, the goals that have been set forth by Charleston County School Board. I think Dr. McGinley is a role model simply because she's a leader. She's willing to take risks, uh, she's competent, she has character. Those are the two elements of leadership and I think that's why she's a role model. When I first met her, I just viewed her as a bureaucrat um, for the school district and so forth and had heard a lot of complaints about the Charleston County School District. But over the years, it has become really clear to me that in a difficult environment, she is willing to push the envelope and to take risks for what's right for the children. And that is, I think, an incredible uh, thing to be doing. What I really admire about Nancy McGinley is that she is incredibly passionate and she is a tireless leader for helping all children and all families succeed in our community. She has stood up and publicly stated that we need to do a better job when it comes to our issues of public education, that we just cannot accept this concept that every child is only guaranteed a minimally adequate education. We as a community are never gonna achieve our bold plan for bold change without the visionary type of leadership that Nancy brings to her job and to this community every day. I am just humbled by this award. Um, I think it means I'm getting old because you have to hang around a while before people start seeing you as a role model. And I start my seventh year as superintendent and right now, I'm the longest serving superintendent Charleston has ever had. I'm very, um, very honored by this award and very honored that um, my, my principals, my teachers have supported me and stayed the course and the, the people who nominated me, um, I, I cannot tell them how, how surprised I was because it's, it's truly um, outstanding to be thought of in that way. Dr. McGinley, I want to extend a congratulations to you for winning this Role Model Award. I could not think of a more deserving person to receive this award. You have been a true role model to myself and to our community by the way that you sacrifice your time, the way you sacrifice your talent, and the way you give back to our community to make it a better place. Nancy, it's a real honor to have a chance to say to you and the folks around you that I think you are just a wonderful leader. It is a pleasure to work with you and I'm honored to have the chance to do that. I wish you all of the best and the greatest success in your current and future endeavors. Thanks for all your help. Nancy, I have told you this many times in person. You by far have the most difficult job of any community leader in this community and you by far have the most important job. I want to thank you not only personally for what you have done for my three children who have gone through the Charleston County School District, but what you have done for every child in helping them to succeed to their full potential. You have done an amazing job, a job that is not always appreciated by everybody in the community, but is certainly greatly appreciated by me and everybody in this room.